Your dreams and thoughts are no longer safe. Watch this. The image of a giraffe that the computer has never seen, it's only looking at the fMRI data, and this is what the computer thinks the human is seeing. What? Yeah. But of course it goes further. So in this one, they said, can they understand um, the inner monologue, the things you're saying to yourself in your own mind? Mind you, by the way, when you dream, your dream, like your visual cortex runs in reverse, so your dreams are no longer safe. Um, but we'll try this. So they had people watch a video and just narrate what was going on in the video in their mind. So there's a woman, she gets hit in the back, she falls over. This is what the computer reconstructed the person thinking. See, a girl looks just like me, get hit in the back, and then she is knocked off. So our thoughts, like, are starting to be decoded. Mind you, by the way, when you dream, your dream, like, your visual cortex runs in reverse, so your dreams are no longer safe. Years ago, I made a video about dreams and stated that dreams are just images and life experiences that are recorded in physical memory throughout your lifetime. I don't believe you go to any astral realm or to other dimensions or alternate realities when you dream. It's just stored memories of images, life experiences, and things you saw gathered from projected screens. Dreams are realities created by your subconscious accessing your physical memory with themes that are based off emotions. Think about it. Have you ever dreamed of a place you've never seen before, like being on another planet? Unless you saw it in the movies, you wouldn't have the image to use to create that dream. Can blind people see in their dreams? According to research, they don't. Why is that if we leave our bodies and go to another dimension? Do newborn babies have nightmares? Most likely not because they don't have the image or experience to support it. Have you ever seen yourself old in your dreams? Are you somebody else in your dreams? According to my past comments, cell phones doesn't work in dreams. Why is that? Does the system think we can make contact in the outside world? Maybe cell phones have worked for you. If so, let me know. Physical memory and dream memory are linked by emotions. You can carry emotions from physical reality to dream reality and vice versa. You can only carry physical memory to dream reality, but you cannot carry dream memories to the physical reality. Only the emotions that's attached to that dream. Two separate storage units. That's why most people can't remember their dreams. Emotions most of the time help you remember your dreams because you brought them back to the physical when you woke up. And once you remember the dream, it now gets stored in the physical memory, which is why you can now recall it. And if you don't remember ever having any dreams, you just might be an NPC. Sometimes your subconscious can make more sense of your reality by dropping the emotional element and form the answers in your dreams. If you are really in tune, your dreams can also predict your future and expose when someone is trying to harm you. In order to be in tune, you need to have a healthy lifestyle. Cut back on the poisons you ingest and go out in nature sometimes. We now live in a world where AI can now read your thoughts. You ever think about something and it appears in an ad? We live in a scary world. Now according to this clip, the man stated that our dreams are no longer safe which means it's very possible that AI can interpret your dreams. And it's easy to believe that because dreams are thoughts and memories. Think about this. You ever had a dream and it starts to get really good and just before the good part happens, you get a phone call in the physical reality? Or how about dreaming and someone knocks at the door at the exact moment you dream someone is knocking at the door? I just recently had a dream that it was people talking outside and one person slammed the large door. It woke me up. I looked out the window and saw it was a group of guys getting into a large truck and was closing the door. That was the sound I heard. How did my dream know that door was going to be slammed at that exact moment? I believe in this simulation that our dreams and our physical reality are both monitored simultaneously. In the movie The Matrix, the movie never talks about someone actually dreaming inside The Matrix. If you're jacked into the system, then it's only logical that the system should also have access to your dreams as well. So being in this simulation, there is no surprise that our dreams are created in our mind and we travel to nowhere except in our own imagination. But in that imagination, there is power, there is foresight, there are ideas, there is motivation, there is growth, there are answers. AI is becoming a dangerous entity, but it can never stop your ideas, your creativity, or stop you from becoming the person you are supposed to be. Keep dreaming. Thank you for listening to me. And if you could do me a favor, hit that like button. That really helps out a lot. Everyone have a great day and I'll talk to you real soon. Peace.